in this video, we gallop into the paddock for Steakhouse Marketing. And see if the evidence stacks up for a lunchtime indulgence. Let's get into the food. First up, it's chorizo meatballs and crispy lamb ribs. Mm-mm. Good taste. Oh, it's cheesy. Oh, it's cheesy. I'm gonna use that toast to make sure I don't make a fool of myself. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> okay, here we have a fried lamb rib. Crispy, it looks. Let's see how it tastes. My man! Heavy on the seasoning, I love that. That is wicked. These guys are well ahead of the game when it comes to their cookery and their methods. A solid entry into the dining experience. Even though this is a great start to set the tone, there's a reason we're here today and it's not for the entrees. Yes, you guessed it, it's for the steak. The moment we've been waiting for. Rum steak. Confit onion. Pom puree. Coleslaw. Sauce Bernays. Let's see. It's a 250 gram rump steak. Ooh, this is looking tough. Oh no, what a shame. But wait. Is it medium rare? Let's find out. Oh yes it is. Just look at that juiciness. You know you want it. See that mash on there. Bit of that burners. It's greens and rum. I'm really gonna enjoy this. Going in for the second bite, this is fully loaded. It's got everything on that plate. <laughs> what I like about the presentation is that it was easy to understand what ingredients were there and how they were cooked. Right. Beef and red wine pie. Looks like a trap. A dish designed to make a sucker out of me. Just look at that. It's juicy. Yes. You know what I'm saying? Skip it. Put that match on there. What the actual. <laughs> Serious man, this is bananas good. As you might have noticed, these dishes fulfilled their destiny. But nevertheless, one thing was really puzzling. We enjoyed the food, but what does a three-year-old think? All right, Evelyn, give it a try. See what you think. The official ice cream tester. Oh. I worked out the genius of the Red Steakhouse. If you've eaten out at a decent restaurant, you'll have noticed a few key things, such as a good location, well-presented staff, products, and decor. We definitely have those here. Typically, you're going to be out of pocket in a significant fashion, which brings about high expectations of an absolutely magnificent experience. One which matches the amount of dosh you're going to drop to dine in. One thing I was completely blown away by was how the Red Steakhouse completely lowers your guard, allowing you susceptible to their cunning ways. Cunning in the sense that they were ready to pounce and absolutely over deliver. To me, this was all part of a well-crafted marketing ploy. The humble Red Steakhouse, you've absolutely smashed it. Congratulations. They drew me in with a two course lunch menu that would have people running off in droves. Why? Because it costs a mere $35 per person. Typically things that aren't expensive tend to lead people to think that they aren't of a good quality. 
This is where the genius part comes in. By charging low on the food, customers might not necessarily be expecting great things. But yes, they still have the great location and the great decor and the stuff and all of those cool stuff. They're probably expecting just something adequate that matches the price point. Listening close for the genius part. You got none of that. We got exceptional food, classic in nature, brilliantly presented, cooked, and absolutely repeatable by staff over and over. This as a system creates a great environment for the customers. The staff are able to do their job simply, effectively, make money for the business, incredible marketing and business practice. Other great marketing tactics like menu pricing, layout structure, and other promotional materials were laid out absolutely perfectly. They weren't obtrusive, they weren't pushy, but yet there were upsells every step of the way with absolutely no resistance needed. The value I got out of this dining experience was immense. Sure, I give the Red Steakhouse a massive thumbs up for both their product and their marketing. If you'd like to go deeper into these topics, feel free to connect with me either down in the comments or drop me a line at hello at deliciousprofits.com. If you're in Brisbane or the Gold Coast or even Northern New South Wales, get yourself down to the Red Steakhouse. You too can enjoy a beautiful dining experience over a glass of vino or two. I've included their website and their socials in the description. Feel free to take a look at their menu and try and understand why I'm so emphatic about this place. Until next time, keep building your delicious profits however you do.